hope everyone's day is off to an amazing start. Thanks so much for stopping in today, guys. Today, here in Atlanta, guys, I woke up around 7.30 today. It is like 35 degrees, 35, 37 degrees, somewhere in that neighborhood here in Atlanta. And it is cold. I really don't do cold all that well. I don't know how those of you who live up north, I don't know how y'all do it. I just don't, I just don't. But um, nevertheless, the sun is shining. It's deceivingly bright outside. You'd think it was like 80 degrees, but it is in the 30s right now. But I'm getting ready to go out and brave this weather regardless. <laughs> a mess. Eric went to the grocery store and um, barely put anything up. So I right now I'm vlogging with my new phone. So you guys will have to let me know what the footage looks like. But so I think what I'm going to do is go to Walmart, see if Walmart still has any hula hoops. Yes, hula hoops, um, because that's the size wreath that I want for our front gate. So I'm gonna see if Walmart has any hula hoops and then I'll buy all the garland and stuff and see if I can't uh, recreate or create a wreath. Um, let me know if you guys got your flu shots this year. I saw on the news on yesterday that Georgia, I think tops the nation with um, complications from the flu. So we did get our flu shot i know a few videos back no it wasn't maybe last year i kind of asked you guys if you were for the flu shot or against it a lot of you said that you don't actually get the flu shot <laughs> Walmart, the one that's not in my area, but I didn't feel like driving too far today. Right, so how cute is this, guys? This wire scarf organizer. They have it here in rose gold, and then there are some just regular gold ones back there. That's really cute. Here are the wreaths. Um, I would say the selection is okay. I still don't see anything quite as large as I want. This one is different. A little poinsettia wreath. Look at this little horsey. You guys see that? Disney Princess Maximus Rendezvous. Hmm. $89. That's cute. I'm actually going to make some toilet bombs for the bathrooms. Um, you guys know a few years ago I actually made toilet bombs. They are great for making and keeping in your bathroom as you're having guests in and out of your bathroom and you need citric acid to make those. Um, but I actually have some citric acid at home. However, what I do need are some jars, now that I think of it, to put the toilet bombs in. I like this one right here. This would be a good size right here for toilet bombs. I like the shape of this jar, but I don't like the color of the lid. I still haven't made my mind up, guys, yet about the air fryer. Um, I know a lot of you have them and you said that you enjoy them, but I am still trying to decide if I want to purchase one. If you have one already, though, let me know which brand of air fryer you would recommend. I see Ninja has one fryer so if you guys have one already let me know I think I may put this on the Christmas list right here this pizza oven I guess this is a pizza oven oh yeah we actually have a toaster oven it's not quite this large um, I see that you can actually put an entire pizza in this one the one that we have you actually have to cut it in half but you guys see how the doors open it's super cool you don't see that price on i was about to say this is 69 dollars i was gonna get it but i don't see any other ones Did you see the price oh there it is 
it's $129.99 by Ulster. I guess I've just given up on the hula hoop now and I'm just in here walking around. Oh, you know what I do need though? I need some mascara. So let's see what they have over here. What's you guys' favorite brand of mascara? I don't know, I don't really have one. I just get what the, whatever has the best display, actually. Um, I do kind of stick to the CoverGirl brand. What is this wonderful, fully real? All right. Let me get that. It looks like it'll get the job done. This has got to be the absolute worst. Um, Walmart fail ever. Um, I will say though, they did have some good stuff. I wasn't really looking for anything other than the hula hoops. So I guess that's why I wasn't able to find anything. Somebody has some really nice smelling perfume in front of me. It has actually warmed up too. So that's good. Lunch was tasty. I am actually re-energized, but I'm kind of hoping that they will actually have the extra large size wreath. All right. I have not been to Lowe's in forever. We have a lot of Christmas trees. Oh my gosh, the Christmas section looks amazing. Do you guys see all the Christmas trees? Look at all the Christmas trees. Wow, really pretty. Really pretty. Let me ask you guys, when is the last time that you guys purchased a new Christmas tree? We've had the same Christmas tree, I wanna say for seven years. When is it time to purchase another Christmas tree? Um, <clears throat> it's not falling apart. You know, you only use it once a year. So do you guys re-up on your Christmas trees real often? I'll take these sunglasses off on the inside now. <clears throat> the Christmas displays here are really pretty. Look at that. Look at that really nice all right so oh my gosh that is the wreath that I want for the gate I'm gonna turn you guys around so you can see all right you guys see that one up there that really really big one right there that is the one that I actually want for the gate you guys think about this one this one isn't the one that I saw hanging, they actually aren't selling that one. That one is just for display. But I like that this one is pre-lit and it only requires batteries. You don't have to plug it in or anything. And it's pretty thick. So, let's see if you guys can see. Can you see the lights come on? Yeah, see that? And, $45.98. And then there's this one. It's also pre-lit and requires batteries, but I'm not sure how I feel about the antlers. 